Welcome to Learning Data Analysis with our video course authored by Fabio Veronesi by Pact Publishing. Before we begin, let me introduce myself. I'm Mark Thomas and I'll be your voiceover artist for this course. Fabio Veronesi obtained a PhD in digital soil mapping from Cranfield University. And then he moved to ETH Zurich where he's been working for the past three years as a postdoc. He learned R during his PhD, and he's been using it every day since. It provides advanced statistical techniques, powerful programming and elegant graphical capabilities. Please visit his personal website, www.fabioveronesi.net, for more information about him and his work. He also maintains a blog, www.r-video-tutorial.blogspot.ch, which he uses to provide short tutorials on the use of R. This video presents an overview of what we'll talk about in the course. R is a powerful programming language ideally suited for scientific research. It features a series of powerful graphical libraries which we're going to explore in details in this course. We'll dive right into the use of powerful libraries for data analysis, therefore you need to be familiar with R to be able to follow the course. This course is divided into 15 sections. We'll start our talk by learning the basics of data, import and manipulation in R. In the first four sections, we'll explore ways to import data in various formats, such as tables, vectors and rasters. Then we'll see how to work with these data, for example by setting the projection and dealing with the time variable. Sections 5 to 9 will deepen your understanding of data analysis in R by representing several sections where you will learn the basics of data analysis. For example, we'll explore descriptive statistic techniques, plotting and manipulating of spatiotemporal data. The final part of the course is fully dedicated to the creation of static and interactive spatiotemporal maps in R. Sections 10 to 15 of the course presents a series of real-life experiments where you'll use real data sets to perform advanced data analysis. For example, we'll learn point pattern analysis, cluster analysis, time series analysis, geostatistical interpolation and machine learning regression. We'll explore advanced techniques to analyse our data in the R programming language. R provides various tools to import and manipulate data in several popular formats. This course will teach you how to do that. A particular focus of this course is the manipulation of spatiotemporal data. We'll explore how to import and thoroughly analyse these data and we'll complete the exercise by creating beautiful and informative interactive maps for the web directly from the R console. These sections are fully dedicated to real-life exercises. Here we'll explore, for example, point pattern analysis using real crime statistics freely available for the United Kingdom. Another technique we're going to learn is cluster analysis, for which we'll explore both the k-means algorithm and hierarchical clustering. We'll also look at time series analysis, which you can use to analyse data collected at regular time intervals. Then we'll shift our focus on estimating data. We'll start with geostatistical interpolation, and Krigging in particular, where we'll create a map of air pollution for the United States. We'll finish the course presenting advanced techniques to perform statistical or machine learning regression. For example, the popular random forest based on regression trees. At the end of this course, you'll learn how to take full advantage of R to perform cutting-edge data analysis. You'll master the tools to work with spatiotemporal data, including creating interactive maps for the web. Finally, at the end of the last sections, you'll be able to perform advanced statistical techniques on your data. We'll always work with real data downloaded from the web, therefore you can be sure that you'll be able to fully reproduce everything you're going to learn in the course.